Hello and welcome everyone, this is your friend Himmel. In this video I'm gonna show you, how to install Fedora on VirtualBox, in Windows 11. So let's start it right away. So first of all, we need to download the ISO file of Fedora. I will give its link on the description box. From this site, download the Fedora Workstation version to install it on VirtualBox. After downloading the ISO file of Fedora, we need to download the VirtualBox X file, to install it on system. After downloading both of these, at first install the virtual box on the system. After installation is done, open virtual box. To set up Fedora, click on new. Type name set its architecture and continue. Now you need to allocate, the RAM for the Fedora system, allocate at least 2 to 4 gigs of RAM. Now, leave everything as it is, and continue. Now, we have to create virtual hard drive and allocate its space, you can allocate it as per your requirement. Basic setup is done, before starting the Fedora system, we need to make few changes on settings, so click on settings. Inside general, go to advanced and set both of these to bi-directional, it enables you to copy and paste files between host machine and Fedora system. Inside system, go to the processor, you can allocate the processor for Fedora system, you can set it up to the green mark. Now, most important part, go to the storage section and attach the Fedora ISO file here, which was downloaded initially. You can leave the other settings as it is, now it's time to the boot up the Fedora system. Choose the starred Fedora. Click on install to hard drive to continue the installation. Choose your language, set your keyboard layout and time zone. Now, click on Installation Destination, and make sure to choose the virtual hard drive, which we created previously. Click on Begin Installation, to start the process. The installation process may take a while. So get a coffee and wait until the completion. After the installation is completed, 
click on finish installation and power off the Fedora system. Now, click on settings and go to the storage section, and the attach the ISO file of Fedora. Now, again start the Fedora system. Now, you will see the screen like this, click on Start Setup and Continue. Make sure you enable the third-party repositories. Enabling the third-party repositories allows, easy installation of the following software, Google Chrome, PCharm, a Python IDE, and Video Graphics drivers, and some other software too. You can set your username and continue. So, we are all done and set to go with Fedora. In this way you can install Fedora on VirtualBox in Windows 11. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, it means a lot to me. See you on next video.